Hey YouTube, it's Never Done Eating. Come with us on our vlog in Miami, Florida. To the Never Done Eating Mobile. First stop at Wawa. Yay! And what do we get? Sandwiches! We got... And prime. Let me see. What flavor is it? Strawberry banana. Nice. We got... They have had some nice options. One of these should be a ciabatta sandwich. And one should be a... Like a cheesesteak. Cheesesteak. Thick up. And what sandwich is this? This is bruschetta sandwich something bruschetta. with a bunch of cheese apparently and bruschetta spread and on ciabatta bread this looks like a lot of bread but it smells amazing two or three cheeses looks like it's a cheddar and provolone it comes with two types of cheese for some reason we're never done eating but when we travel we also like to be economical and budget friendly and your local Wawa, Royal Farms, maybe 7-Eleven might be a good place to stop for a sandwich. Oh yes, and for, <laughs> so funny. and for your littles and your family that only want beef and cheese, I don't see the cheese. This is a perfect size. <laughs> Alright, keep traveling with us. Yay, see you in the next stop. Slow it down. It's about jangles, girl. Respect about when it's jangles. Hold on. <laughs> oh, they cut in half for us? <laughs> it's just paper. Why would half of it be white? Because mommy is possible. Okay, almost the neck. This is out. nicely wrapped. Look at that. That's above jangles. Let's get that crunch. Mmm. That's a lot. Mmm, crunchy. Mmm, girl. And this is a spicy sandwich, too. Meat seems real. If you could, cook, if you could only see that look on that face when I was listening to that crunch. You know what? Don't make me eat your whole sandwich. Mm. We haven't had a real mayo in a very long time, if you So, fun fact for anyone that's listening, Dover, Delaware used to have this place called Golden Skillet. And they had the best fried chicken sandwich. When my wife devours my sandwich. And Bojangles chicken <laughs> sandwich is, is like the Golden Skillet. So, if you ever looking for a great chicken sandwich and everybody's hooked on chick-fil-a and everything but bojangles is the real deal old school style all right the travel continues peace out all right looks like our uh, our coffee order is finally coming need a little pick me up to stay alert while we're on these roads but thankfully it's been pretty clear today not too much traffic uh it's a saturday uh-oh Let's start with popping boba. Yeah, yeah. It's their new 4th of July themed summer drink. Nice. And tastes like slushy. And they don't have pistachio anymore, but I got to macadamia. That's their new flavor. All right. Thank you, Mommy. You're welcome. What'd you get for yourself? Um, what does it say? Yes, the oat milk with the brown sugar. Nice. Shaken. So like I was Not saying, stirred. we got off in Emporia, Virginia. It is, if you're coming from Delaware, taking the Bay Bridge Tunnels down 113. Emporia is the last major town city before you get on to uh, 95. So we got Starbucks, as you can see. Back and Boba, up. that's pretty cool. And uh, we have a KFC, a Taco Bell. Across the street, as I mentioned, there's a Radisson, a country in the suites by Radisson where you can rest. We got a Burger King, gas station, oh, Food Lion. Oh, yeah. yeah. 
the food line over there, over there. And uh, anyway, back to the Never Done Eating Mobile. Yeah. Hold on, let me zoom out. Our house subs first. Thank you. Oh wow, nice and big in here. here This is the New Yorker and it has pastrami. I don't remember what else. Mm -hmm. But it also has this Italian dressing and I thought, okay. But it works so well because it brings that little bit of a sour kick to the sweetness of this pastrami. Oof. Mm. And that one, both of them have such soft bread. And this is the jerk, Jamaican jerk turkey, as opposed to chicken. And the bread is thin. I love that the bread is thin. And I love the fact that there's more toppings, so then you feel like it's a little healthier, because maybe there's more vegetables. But the sauce is quite interesting. Looking at it makes me hungry, so I'm gonna have a bite. Mm. Hold on. Delicious. What an edible straw. No way. Edible straw? You, I got you a peanut paradise smoothie that has peanut butter, banana, non fat yogurt, and whey protein to keep you nice and full for the drive ahead. That kind of looks like peanut butter treats for a dog. It's a it's a peanut paradise. Yeah. <laughs> All right. No, I've never done eating mobile. Excuse us. It smells like nice pine out here, doesn't it? <laughs> right. You see on the left. See the signs and the little tower with the sombrero hat. Because that's the little thing is like south of the border, like it's like little Mexico or something. 
it's actually a lot better than what it was. When I was a kid, it was very, um, there was all kinds of things you could go, like game rooms, fireworks, all of that. And then for a while, there was nothing going on. It was like falling apart, but now they redid a bunch of stuff. They have uh, miniature golf and all kinds of things now. These Carolinas, yes, we drive to Florida all the time. All right, YouTube family, we decided to rest for the first night here. We are in Hardyville, Hardyville, South Carolina. So very close to Savannah, Georgia, four hours from Orlando. And we're here at the Fairfield Inn. Good night. Breakfast here in the morning from 6 to 10. It's very nice, very clean. I think this hotel is brand new. Um, or maybe a few months old based on the reviews. Pool outside. Put in 10 hours driving today. It's a long day. Can't wait to go to the room. Connect and print. Microwave, a little fridge down there. The blinds open and close with this little panel on the wall, so just in case you're trying to figure things out, thermostat, two queen bed, sanitize, decent. Uh, what do we say? Oh, it's like a 50 inch TV. Who is this made by? Oh, Samsung, so it's probably a 55, because we know LG does weird sizes like 49 and something. Decent sized desk if you want to do some work or eat. Um, lamp. Your standard bedding. Some coffee for the morning. So this is a quick tour. So far it looks very clean. What do you guys think? Yeah, it looks very nice. And the beds were made very nicely. We sprayed them. Front. Them. They're made very nicely and the pillows were nice and stuffed. And it looks like it's clean. Our little bear is tired. She did a great job today. All right, this is the end of day one. We'll see you in the morning for breakfast. Peace out. Mm -hmm. Hey YouTube, good morning, this is day two. We are leaving the hotel. We don't feel like having breakfast, so we're gonna go to Starbucks right there. This is pretty convenient. And we have about four more hours to drive to Orlando and then to Miami. And we'll see you along the way, bye. That's the front desk. Yesterday.
<laughs> sure, if you don't mind. And this, that's just the best thing. <laughs> this young lady let me see her waffle. Very cool. Thank you. And I never make them that great, so I'm glad you showed me yours. <laughs> you gotta fill it up. That's the key? Yeah, a little more than that. Uh, so fill that, put it in, and then take a little more and put it in. Very cool. <laughs> you heard it here first. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Safe travels. Okay, you too. Thank you. That's it for this part of the trip. We're gonna keep it moving. Hey YouTube, never done eating. All right, day two. We showed you the outside of the hotel last night. Uh, so you get a chance to see it during the daytime. The surrounding area is very safe, comfortable to sleep, I'd say, right? Yep. Yeah. Well, she's always... Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, it was comfortable, it was clean, all you can ask for. It. They do have breakfast, but we decided to get breakfast elsewhere because we need to get down to Orlando. So we'll see you later. Bye. Peace. In case you want to know how tall I am, <laughs> I don't even know what this is anymore. That is a cold brew it. with the foam, some kind of cold foam yeah. that you forgot about. Cold brew with some kind of foam <laughs> that I forgot about. <laughs> so it's, it's whatever. But it's and a cinnamon dolce latte cinnamon because dolce that's latte. always good. And guess what? Free coffee is a tap away. Tap that. We should have gotten a free drink today because Mother's Day. Mommy, like what? You didn't tap that. That's why you did Frey, what do you have? Um, Matcha with strawberry fun. Ooh. We have the, the, the breakfast impossible, impossible breakfast sandwich. So That's the one. Impossible sausage, vegan sausage with egg and cheese. So it's a mix of can I eat this or can I not if you're vegan, I guess. No, if you're vegan, you shouldn't. But if you're vegetarian, you can. I mean, cheat day, right? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. This is a mix of better than we would have gotten at the hotel. No no shade to the hotel. The hotel was very, very, very clean, but their food... Standard Standard, that's true. ...for a hotel that doesn't have um, like a real on-site restaurant. All right. All right, see you during our next stop. Peace. You want to go Bubba Gumps? All right, let's go there.
Happy Mother's Day, my man. Thank you. Things about the bar. We didn't get a chance to see what yours is. I didn't want a baby cup. No, because you're not a baby anymore, are you? Perfect. I don't know why I took this one. 
Do you have a bite? Marinated it all? Past its prime, where I feel like it's the sesame seed mixture. Like almost like it should be. Yeah. We're gonna dive in and we'll report back after. Bye. So we realized that we drove from Delaware to Florida to just not have a good meal, and I think that's why we forgot to turn our mics on. There were definitely some spoiled tomatoes in my guacamole, so I guess they decided to save them and still use them in the dish. It didn't work. This tasted like chicken salad. Didn't work. The steak? The steak was actually the best part. It didn't work. So we realized that we drove 14 hours. The drinks were nice and the napkins were folded neatly.
not Kendra Scott. <laughs> that way, to the thingamajigger. Hello. Uh -oh. 